What's good guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 MT as well as NFL 20 Muck Coins, please go to dvdj.com, link will be in the description, use code BUGS for 10% off at checkout. What's good YouTube, it's your boy BUGS back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video, and today, um, well, first of all, this video is pre-recorded as per usual. Before we get into it, drop 10k in the comments, like the vid, and sub if you are new for a chance of winning 10k MT. The vid hits 25 likes and someone will get uh, 10k MT. So make sure to hit that like, drop a sub if you're new, post it every day, two times. So let's get into it. So as you can see, these packs are expiring tomorrow. Good news. It looks like we're going to get a new Legacy Showcase. So it looks like, yeah, this Micon is going to be out of packs or Meekin, whatever. Uh, James Silas or whatever his name is and Junior Bridgman all these dudes are gonna be out of packs and there's gonna be new content tomorrow So with that said, um, you guys know the drill. I'll go over it This is a video to make MT off the new content coming out and pretty much I'll drop this about two hours before content drops Which is a dub for you guys I'm gonna go over everything involved with the market and how to make MT off these new cars dropping So let's get into it. So First off, what I always say before new content drops, I think you guys know by now if you're a loyal sub, go ahead and sell your cards. As you can see, I just sold that Curry for 54k. So right now on my team, this is who I have. I'm going to show you what I sold and all that good stuff. So right now, all I have that's sellable is Paul Pierce, the new Scotty, and Hakeem. So when new content drops, what happens? Market crashes. And every single card in the game goes down. So now let me show you what I'm talking about. We're going to NBA 20. So pretty much what crashes is the current day cards crash. But Hakeem and all the new cards like Pippin, Hakeem, all those new cards in the series really won't get affected by it because those packs are still in the game. You know, it won't really affect the cards that are still, um, it won't really affect the cards that are in packs, like different packs. So as you can see, bro, NBA 20 cards are at their highest price in a really long time. I mean, really, really high, okay? So now, if you have any of these cards, you gotta sell them. I, I'm telling you right now, it's just, it's every week, okay? I say this every video, pretty much. Literally, I just make all my MT off these cards and new cards that come out. So, let me just tell you, what you wanna do, simply, you get your cards out of your lineup. Every current day card, for instance, Curry, Paul George, all them, like Giannis, every current day, Ami, Ruby, Sapphire, Right now, you go on the auction, you sell them. Why do I say sell them? Because these packs crashed auction, but three days later, they slow down, the auction goes back up. It's a It happens every time. It's just what happens with the market in 2K. So right now, market's at its high peak, okay? Tomorrow, when these packs are gone, they're probably going to drop a new legacy showcase. Um, maybe it'll be a small forward, I'm guessing, or a shooting guard. So if they do drop one, um, they will... That, that's just good for us because their prices, these prices right here, if you have any of these cards, hold on to them, they're going to go up in value. They're out of packs forever. You're never going to see them again in packs unless they drop some weekly reward garbage that no one cares about. So here we go. So we got all these cards out of the game. If you have them, once again, hold on to them. Now, when new content comes out tomorrow, okay, market crashes. So what you want to do, you sell your cards, market crashes. And now what you want to do is when the market crashes, I would say about 20 minutes in. So let's say the packs come out 20 minutes later or 15 minutes later, whatever. You want to hop on this filter right here, okay? This is how I make all my MT. You hop on this filter and you just keep refreshing. When you see all the cards get at a base of like 32K, you want to start buying. I would say 32K and under. You can even get it for cheaper because I got a ton of Paul Georges. I got a Curry's for 30K on the last market crash. So... Get ready for that. Honestly, I say all these cards right here go down about 8 to 10K. So get ready for that. You're going to make a ton of MT. Now, this is the method. So new content might drop Friday. I'm not sure. But honestly, definitely tomorrow, I would say. So since new content's coming tomorrow, get ready for this filter. This filter is going to be really hot. If you have any silvers, any bronzes, sell them too. So what you want to do is you want to pretty much set your tomorrow. Or I should, I should say today because this is pre-recorded. What you want to do, you want to say your filter to about 33k, or even if you want to do 35k, 36k, just to see a couple cards, see how quickly they're selling, how quickly cards are getting posted. So tomorrow you're going to see a ton of kids rush to the auction block and undercut everybody. That's what happens. Also, uh, when they drop packs, you don't have a guaranteed chance of pulling the players in the pack. So 
They have chances of pulling Amethyst like Kawhi Leonard, Paul George, and Curry. Um, the supply is going to be really high. Demand is going to be low. So, like I said, you stay on this filter. You're going to make a ton of empty. Now, this filter, I'm telling you right now, is made me over 200k MT, I would say. And I literally work all day. I have a lot of MT. I work all day. And all I really do is grind this market. So, ready. 37k now. Remember these words. In about two hours or three hours, whenever the content drops, these cars will be around 32 under, okay? They're under 32k. Now, listen, you're probably going to see a ton of cars at 32k, and it's going to kind of freak you out. Don't get freaked out by the fact that a lot of them are 32k. Nobody's buying the cards. You're going to be the one that's smart, and you're going to buy all. If you have like 200k MT, try to pick up four or five 30k players, 30k Amis like Paul George, Kawhi, Curry, whatever. Um, for like for instance, they all go around the same price, especially Curry, because Curry has a higher market value. Same with Giannis and AD. So if you could somehow get, I got a ton of Curries. I think two weeks ago. 30k i got three curries for 33k and under i sold all of them for like 59k that's a ton of profit made okay so make sure you keep looking at this filter if it's a little dry go by go by player name go to paul george go to curry go to Giannis. go to ad that's how i mostly got my snipes and you're gonna see a lot of three hours and 59 minute cards which means they just got posted so if they just got posted that's good make sure you do not get any cards for like 36k you gotta be patient. Do not cop any of these cards for 36K. You will not make any MT. You'll maybe make 1K if that. Make sure you get them for under 32. I would, all right, 32,500 and under, okay? That's the lowest, that's the highest I'll go. It's 32,500, 32, okay? That is the lowest. Now, also, so let's talk about this as well. So, if you guys, um, I've been talking about Paul Pierce a lot because he's been out of packs for about a week and his price, I want to check it. I'm pretty sure he did rise a lot. So since those cards are out of the game, you can make a ton of MT. And as you can see, he was 46K in my last video. I, but I think last week he was 46K, maybe like five days ago, I posted a video on it. He's, he's slowly creeping up. And for sure, there's not a lot on the auction. As you can see, these are all like newly posted cards. I say I give it about what, five more days, and this car will probably be at 65, 70, maybe even 80K. So hold on to your pierces, okay? So now also, what you want to do. So now let's check James Silas or Silas's price. I don't know how to say his name, okay? So we're going to check out this new this Amethyst card from last week or two weeks ago. And we're going to see if we get a couple. Right now, if you have some MT, you can maybe pick up one or two. You make some MT quickly. So let's see. We got one for 14, 13, 3. All right, so 13.3, as you can see, there's not that many in the auction as there was when the, pa the packs first came out. So if you want to try to pick up one for 12, hold on to them for, uh, I would say, like a week. You can make probably like 5K MT profit, especially since he's going to be out of the game. Really good car to pick up. Cheaper car. It's an Amethyst. Some people are going to want him, so you can pick him up. And as well, Junior Bridgman. Uh, and also, uh, I'm pretty sure you need to do these collections for the mystery cards. Let's get Let's check that out. Uh, it's in premium prime. I, I don't think you do. Do you need it? How does this work? Where is it? Legacy, George, Mike, and okay, you don't. But these collections are still going to be worth it. Make sure you get these cards before they go away because you will make a ton of MT. So overview of what I'm telling you to do. First off, go ahead and sell all NBA 20 cards right now. If you're watching this video, do not wait. If you wait, you will lose MT. Go ahead, sell your whole entire NBA 20 team, okay? Sell them, get your MT. Try to, if you're on at like 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock Eastern, the content will probably drop around 12, 1 o'clock Eastern. Make sure you get rid of them fast. Market crash is coming, Get stay prepared. So after that, they all sell. Let's say you, you get like 150K MT, okay? Get ready for Amethyst cards. And also, when they drop these new packs, I'm predicting... Another two amethyst, maybe maybe pink diamond, one diamond, and two amethyst. If they do drop that, okay, try to go for the amethyst. Like I got Scotty and uh, Hakeem off the new content, so that's what you want to do. Go for the amethyst. Um, try to snipe them out. That those are the hotter cards. They're more common to pull and they're more expensive. The diamonds are going to be like over 100k. So what you want to do? Simply refresh at the amethyst. Refresh your NBA 20 Amethyst and all the new card Amethysts that come out. You can even do Ruby if you have lower MT. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That's all we got for today. I uh, hope this makes sense. Make a ton of MT with me. I will show you how much MT I made 
and what players I picked up in the next day. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Market crash tomorrow, baby. I'm hyped. Hope you guys had a good one. Stay blessed. Peace.